Hey, what's going on everyone? Bobby from Repair Shopper, and it's time for another episode of Feature Friday. This week, I'm able to finally discuss something that I've been waiting for for quite a while. For those of you that have been with us for, for some time and have been using the accounting integrations, you'll know that one of the features that is in the Zero integration that was not in QuickBooks Online was the ability to sync payments from Zero into Repair Shopper. Well, we've gotten a load of feedback from people that you really wanted this option available so that you could capture payments inside of QuickBooks if maybe you're using a payment integration that's not directly correlated with Repair Shopper, um, along with several other types of workflows. I'm happy to say that it's finally possible if you're using QuickBooks Online to have payments automatically sync from QBO into Repair Shopper. So let's get into this. How do you start doing that? Well, the setup's actually really easy. All you need to do is head over to the QuickBooks settings and in the, whoop, misclick, strictly professional, I promise. All right, so once you're on the QuickBooks settings page, there's a new option here called Sync Payments from QuickBooks. All you need to do is check that and hit Save QuickBooks Settings. That's all that's required. Once you do that and you create an invoice in Repair Shopper and it syncs as you can see here. I have a invoice that's synced with some line items. It's not paid and then head over to QuickBooks. You'll see again the invoice is synced over. It matches up. All you need to do here is take your payment inside of QuickBooks Online and it will sync automatically over to Repair Shopper. Now I'm going to stop right here for a second and point out a few details about how this works. The payment will automatically sync across to Repair Shopper, but it's important to note that this is set up to run once a day. And what will happen is, is when the payment sync runs, it will look back across the past 24 hours and sync any payments that are attached to invoices that came from Repair Shopper. Uh, so in the demo I'm showing you now, it's working kind of instant, but that's because I'm in a sandbox. I'm not actually in production, and I wanted to show everyone what the flow actually looked like. So again, this job only runs once a day, but it will go back 24 hours and sync any payments that have invoices that were synced from Repair Shopper. And that's the important part, is you still need to create the invoice in Repair Shopper, and it needs to sync across to QuickBooks Online. Once that happens, you can take a payment in QuickBooks and have it sync back across to Repair Shopper. So let me refresh this screen here. And there you go. It says paid, and you'll see the, the payment get created and applied. It's important to note that the method for the QuickBooks payment will be very similar to what it looks like for zero, except it will say QBO import rather than zero import. So again, it's finally possible to automatically have payments come from QuickBooks Online over into Repair Shopper as long as you have a synced invoice. I really hope everyone enjoys this. I know that I can name several folks that are already probably jumping for joy over this. And yeah, I look forward to showing off more stuff as we're able to start talking about all the new cool things coming out. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, everyone.